Hello my loves and welcome back to my channel. It is Rona Cole here and today I am sharing with you how I put together my hot cocoa slash coffee bar. This hot chocolate bar is super affordable with most of the things coming from Dollar Tree. I love doing things every year during the holidays because my kids love it. They have so much fun adding marshmallows and sprinkles and coming up with all of these combinations with the syrups. They think they are real life Starbucks baristas. So if you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Also, turn on that notification bell so you are notified every time I upload a video. So let's hop right into it. I'm going to start by wiping down this countertop. There's so much glitter and random berries and just things that have fallen off of ornaments and picks. Everything is clean. I'm going to start putting my syrups into these little glass bottles that I got from the Dollar Tree. I ran across these during the summer and knew they would be perfect for my coffee area. I'm just going to add this dish riser and cover it with a towel that I purchased last year. You could also use stacked books or an old box to add height. So of course if you have hot cocoa you have to have marshmallows. I'm adding marshmallows to this glass jar that I purchased from Dollar Tree. These little shakers are perfect for cocoa and cinnamon. And no, you guys, I'm not talking to myself. Caleb was below me trying to get me to hold him. The little red cake plate I got from Bargain Hunt, but I think it originally came from Target. The glass riser I use is actually a Bath and Body Works candle jar. I just clean them out and keep them to use throughout the house. The coffee cup on top is from Dollar Tree. The hazelnut wafers and the hot cocoa packs are also from Dollar Tree. I 
Dollar Tree had a lot of different flavored candy canes, so I picked up some Smarty flavored candy canes for the kids. So in the opposite corner, I decided to put a little Christmas tree I got from Bargain Hunt a couple of years ago. The framed decor, it says they follow the star that is from at home I got at the end of last Christmas season. Candle holder is actually an oil warmer that I got from Dollar Tree last year. And of course, no hot chocolate bar is complete without a cute little sign. The sign is from Dollar Tree as well. And this is the final result. I am probably going to add some ribbon around the syrup containers to make it a little bit more festive. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.